today I'm going to be showing you guys a blitz needle, which is one of my favorite weapons to take along on Firestorm Citadel runs. And we'll take a closer look at the gun so we can see some of its details. And as you can see, the blitz needle's barrel is huge, and it has like a golden halo rotating around the tip of the barrel there, so it looks pretty sweet. And I'll give you a roundabout view of that. And the handle to the gun is just dwarfed in size compared to the barrel. It's probably one of the biggest barrels on any of the guns in Spiral Knights, I'd say. And for the Blitz Needle's basic attack, you shoot off two charges of needles. There's one, two, right after the other. Then you reload. So, one, two, reload. And for your charge attack, you shoot off a volley, then keep on charging the weapon. And when you release it, you shoot off a huge volley of uh, needles that really does a lot of damage. Now the Blitz Needle is great against the Beast and the Fiend family because it's dealing piercing damage. And right here we're taking care of a pack of Wolvers. And as you see it's getting the job done but it's really not the most practical weapon for this little scenario here. Now the Blitz Needle is basically useless against the Slime and the Construct family. And right here we're in the Jelly Palace and the Blitz Needle is basically like the worst weapon you could ever bring to the Jelly Palace because right here, I think, yeah, we're only dealing 10 damage with each needle shot. But the Blitz Needle is known the best for its usefulness on Firestorm Citadel runs. And it's basically an essential for these runs because right here we have some Trojans, and with one charge attack, we took out that guy. Then we faked this guy out and then just come around and just one more charge attack and it takes him out. Very useful against the Trojans there. But what it's known for the best is for taking down Lord Vanaduke because with each of its charge attacks on him it deals over 1000 damage so it's great for if you like to do solo runs or even if you're in a group. So I think with this one we take him down. Yep. So it's basically the best weapon you can bring on a Firestorm Citadel run besides a good sword and maybe a Shiver Mist. So if you are interested in getting a Blitz Needle, you'll first need to get your hands on an auto gun. Then you're going to want to take that to a needle shot. And you can take your needle shot to a strike needle. Then you can take your strike needle to a Blitz Needle. And thanks for watching guys, I really appreciate the views.